Have you ever wanted whiter, brighter teeth? I always do. Here's something that has been in my family for years. Um, it takes about two weeks to see a result, but it's something you may already have at home. But if not, it's very cheap to go get. I'll show you what it is. It's actually, there's two things that you can do, okay? So the first one I want to show you is baking soda. So baking soda and water. I have this little cup here. You can use any little cup. And I'm just taking a half a teaspoon of baking soda, dropping it in here. Then I take the equal amount of water, which is a half a teaspoon. Okay. Just like that. Mix it up a little bit. It's in like a little paste. You can make it a little thicker if you want. Okay, once you got it all mixed up, then you want to put it on your toothbrush and brush your teeth. As you're brushing your teeth, it will get through the cracks and start to brighten. This takes about two weeks time doing it either every other day or twice a week. So that's the first method. So baking soda actually clears up stains on your teeth. Okay, and there's something else that you may have at home that also does that. And this is a one step thing. And I found a bottle of this for 39 cents, and it is peroxide. Most whiteners at home, and even most of the dental whiteners, contain peroxide. It's usually a much more concentrated percentage of peroxide than what we buy at the store, but this does work. The only problem is, is that the peroxide and your saliva interfere with each other, and it may not be as effective as a tray method. So if this isn't enough whitening for you, you may want to talk to your dentist or if you experience any tenderness or redness, also speak to a dentist. Another little tip is that no one under the age of 13 should be whitening their teeth. Okay, so I have another little cup and I'm going to pour a little bit of peroxide in. Okay, so just a little bit and I'm just going to dip a toothbrush in this. Okay. And then what you want to do is you just want to kind of get it on your teeth and then it'll start bubbling up and that's what it's doing when it's bubbling it's cleaning your teeth. Okay guys, so I want you guys to comment if you've ever tried baking soda and water to whiten your teeth or peroxide. Try it and let me know what you think, okay? Alright, two weeks. I want to hear from you. Bye bye. Women, we are always having hormonal fluctuations between getting our periods, getting pregnant, um, change of life.